five miles, today it could be a single mile or half a mile. And the government is still arguing that single tower data is not very accurate. In addition to this, uh, many of you, if you have crappy cell phone service in your home, may have called up the phone company, threatened to quit, or threatened to cancel your contract, and then the phone company may have sent you a femtocell or a picocell. These are small cell towers that will likely cover just your living room or your, or your house. Uh, I, I get coverage in about half of my house with, with mine. Um, and with these single towers, I mean, the location information from, it, from those single towers is your house. That is the, the, the full range of those towers. The government hasn't addressed this point specifically, but there are more femto cells and pico cells out in the field now than there are regular towers. Now, obviously, you're, you're more likely to be talking to a regular tower because their range is larger, but the government's theories really haven't, really haven't matched up with the realities of cell phone tower deployment. The, they, the density of cell phone towers and the shrinking coverage area are around them. So, there is the, the what I hear from these two presentations is that there are some real anomalies um, in the law um, that 